What's up, everybody? It's Cashflow Nexus, your favorite chart analyst, back again, giving you the latest and greatest updates on the financial markets. And today we will be taking a closer look at Bitcoin. It's been a while since I looked at Bitcoin, so today is the day that we will take a look at it. And if you are new to this channel and you like what you see and hear and feel compelled to sub, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications on future content and posts. That being said, today let's get started with today's list. We'll start off with scripture because God comes first on this channel at number one. Number two, a subscriber shout out. And three, we'll get into the nitty gritty of what everybody wants, the technical analysis. So today's scripture, we're coming out of Matthew chapter four and four, King James Version. But he answered and said, it is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. So it doesn't matter if you're a believer. It doesn't matter if you are a non-believer. You're going to live by his word because his word cannot lie. His word is going to come true at all times. And if you don't have any word in you, you're killing your spirit and your spirit is dying. Whether you want to believe that or not, if you have a relationship with God in Jesus Christ, through Jesus Christ, you will know what I'm talking about. But the, the, every, anybody that doesn't have a relationship with Jesus Christ can't understand what I'm saying here. So to you, it sounds like I'm talking crazy. But uh, I want to challenge you guys for next year because I, I, I have a relationship with Jesus Christ and my Heavenly Father. And I just want you guys to know that it's not too late. It's always it's always a good time to you know just reach out and step out on faith. I challenge you to just give God a try taste and see that the Lord is good and you know you guys I I can't you know make things up <laughs> I wasn't the best person you know living this life that we live but you know things happen for a reason God could transform anybody and it's amazing to me how he could pick someone like me to you know give this teaching to you guys because uh, it's it's his word is real. Every word that comes out, it's real. So that's my message. I, I just want to be real with you guys and be authentic and be 100% about who I am with you guys. Because I'm not going to make up anything and feed uh, you nonsense. Uh, that being said, today's subscriber shout out goes to Adrian Longoria. Uh, thank you for... Because, you know, show me love to my channel. And if you are wanting to get a subscriber shout out on this channel, you know, feel free to, you know, send me your thoughts and talk to me in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys are like thinking. I like to re interact with you guys. I like real conversations that have meaning. I don't like trolls. I don't respond to troll comments, so don't expect it. Every now and again, I will just to put them in, the trolls in their place. But, you know, <laughs> that being said, let's jump right into this technical analysis, what we all been waiting for. So Bitcoin, it looks like it wants to go up, but the clouds are telling us otherwise. We got quite a few levels of resistance to get past. This is a zone that I have. Uh, looking at it closely, this is the area that Bitcoin will need to get through to even touch this green zone. Anything passing this green zone will be bullish territory. So I have it designed this way. But we have major resistance right here in the cloud. Chiku Span is telling us that we've been ranging. If you could see, we've been ranging from let's see 6,676 level to the 7,724 level so we've been ranging in here so I'm expecting us to move towards the downside Kijinsen right here is telling us that price wants to move further to the downside we're already we are already getting rejection at this level here that I've already drawn out this is all a resistance zone from this top of the wick to this top of the wick and this uh, open of this uh, bearish candle that came down. So this whole zone here is bearish. I mean, it's resistance. You already have this cloud here. Uh, it's wicking here quite a bit. So I'm expecting price to move lower down here 
or back to this region I will mark this as well to be keep my eyes on this so I'll write in this area so if we take a look at this particular pair on the hour time frame it looks like price wants to move even further down as we already showing signs of rejection here uh, looking at it on the RCI it looks like the trend is starting to make its way down if you're not familiar with this indicator the RCI line the green line represents the trend when trend is, when the line is above the 80 or the 70 uh, positive 80 or 70 that means the market is you know strong as you see here the opposite is said when it's a downtrend so you know we have you see that it's been trending up now it looks like it wants to start trending to the downside so playing it off of the 15 minute time frame will probably be what is best for this scenario uh let's take a look at it on the 15 minute time frame as you see that trend is already starting to push down uh, you see it here it's clear uh looking at it this was this purple zone this was this box that we were in and this purple zone here was the uh resistance level that i had marked off if you don't remember so yeah it looks like price wants to start making its way to the downside if we were playing this ichimoku style to trade this it would be i would wait for it for chiku span to get through the cloud so we could get a better move to the downside so you won't get stuck in this clutter chiku span is telling us that it may range in here then take moves on to the downside so i will be watching this uh what i'm expecting here for to enter this market um let's see so you already know that trend is down the red line is our signal line what's going to happen is uh, i'm going to wait for this red line to break back down and allow us to continue that trend to the downside as you see here we go back if you see here you see that when it broke down this way this formed when it went up this went up when it went back down it went back down here and kept on doing the same thing but when it's up like this it's a, saying that there's a strong uptrend in this case it's a strong downtrend so i'm expecting for this to break to the downside before entering the market and i'm expecting the market to go down let's get back on the hour on the daily time frame again i'm expecting price to come here to this range and with between this range here but black, back to this black line first and then down to this red zone in here so that's my analysis for you guys today uh bitcoin's going down um xrp is going down the market is going down uh not much to say but you know stay positive the market is doing what it needs to do make money if you are a hodler sorry you're not making no money if you are a margin trader which i strongly suggest you start learning how to do and read these charts for yourself definitely jump in on these markets and make these make this money it's it's a lot of money out here in this crypto space that being said god bless you guys hope you enjoyed this analysis take care and god bless peace